day two. And with this restaurant in financial hell, Gordon knows that he needs to increase business. But he also needs to find ways to cut costs. I've been thinking about this overnight, and what's bugging me now is, what's he wasting in his fridges? That's my concern now. This must be a pain in the ass. The minute a muscle opens, then no longer fresh. They're gone. That's dangerous. That's is dead. Muscle's dead. This menu is far too big for his own good. I don't understand what's going through his mind to have this fridge stocked with all these ingredients and no customers to cook for. Look, bag after bag after bag. There's nearly two months' worth of chopped garlic there. This is where his $80,000 debt is in all these ingredients. This fridge is stocked now like a restaurant that would be fully booked for three, four weeks in advance, and we haven't got those customers. So why the fuck have we got all this ingredient? Stupid. Absolutely crazy. With a young head chef and an inexperienced owner, Gordon decides it's time for Restaurant Management 101. You're in charge of the purchasing, yeah? Those fridges are stocked up for a, a busy restaurant. We haven't got money to waste. There's endless ingredients in there that are not being used properly. Everything we buy is costing money. I can point fingers in every direction for the, the walk-ins being crowded, and it's a catch-22, because we run out of something. Joe throws a fit. When was the last time you had a budget? Per week is $4,200 a minute. I don't think we're scrutinizing what we're purchasing. I could go in there and just give you $500 of waste. I saw that fucking walk-in in a completely different light. I went, holy shit. 